I am a champion of character. 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 My mom thinks I should be the leading scorer on my team. That's nothing. My dad says I'm going to get a college scholarship. College scholarship? I wish. My dad says I'm heading straight to the pros. I wish my parents understood my role on the team. My mom always complains about my playing time, but I just want to have fun. Sure, I'd like to play as much as possible, but that's not the only reason I play. I think my dad would rather have me quit if his goals aren't met. Hello, my name is Dr. Robert Hayward. The goal of the Champions of Character process is to teach character through sport. In talking to young athletes all around the country, our process has found that there are some things that parents can do to help sports and activities build character. The first thing parents can do at the start of any season is to ask themselves the following questions. Do I want my competitor to participate? If so, why? What will be a successful season for me as a parent? What are the goals for my competitor? What do I hope my competitor will gain from the experience? What do I think my competitor's role will be on their team? Parents, after you've answered these questions, ask your high school athlete or competitor these questions and listen to his or her answers. Why are you playing? What is a successful season? What goals do you have? What do you think your role will be on the team? Parents, once you have heard your competitors' answers, compare them to your own. If both sets of expectations are the same, great. However, if your responses are different, you need to drop your expectations and accept theirs. Why? Because your competitors' high school experience belongs to them. It's their learning experience. It is a safe environment where life's lessons can be learned. When parents do not drop their expectations, trouble can begin for the competitor and potential character building lessons can be sacrificed. For example, most competitors will tell you that the reason they are competing is to have fun. However, most parents' expectations have little to do with fun. When expectations do not match up, a conflict will eventually arise. 70% of all young people stop competing in a team sport by the age of 12. The number one reason they cite for quitting is that they no longer have fun. Athletes consistently relate their feelings that their parents do not understand their role and almost always feel that their role is larger than what the athlete knows it to be. Many times it's because parents are blinded by the athletic college scholarship. Many parents will tell you they want their child to earn an athletic college scholarship. Although it is great to have goals, the reality is that there are very few athletic scholarships and scholarship dollars available. If your athlete is male, find his sport on the following chart. Now find out how many other athletes are in his sport and how many scholarships and scholarship dollars are available. What is the average scholarship worth in his sport? Now let's do the same thing for our female athletes. Parents find her sport on the following chart. Now find out how many athletes there are in her sport and how many scholarships and scholarship dollars are available. What is the average scholarship worth in her sport? Again, it's great to have goals, but if your son or daughter's goal is college, make sure he or she is pursuing academics in such a way to make it a reality. There is only one guarantee that exists during the sports season. And that is, no season will be perfect.
Even without disagreements between parents, players, and coaches, problems will always occur. Before this happens, it is important that both parents and athletes understand everyone's expectations. So parents, drop yours and adopt ours so we can take advantage of sports life lessons and become a champion of character. So parents, drop yours and adopt ours so we can take advantage of sports life lessons and become champions of character. This message is powered by PlayNAIA.org. Nearly 300 colleges and universities participating in 23 National Collegiate Championships. Go to PlayNAIA.org to find out how you can get in the game. Funding for this video was provided by Musco Sports Lighting, the worldwide leader in sports lighting.